John McIntyre, owner of the incredible art. Start it now. Restart it. Go ahead. Hi, everybody. This is John McIntyre, owner of the Incredible Art Gallery. We're here in Houston, Texas, and we kind of wanted to give you an idea of what our shows are all about. We take our wonderful, famous artist Christopher Clark on tour at various cities throughout the nation, and uh, this is one of them. We're on our final day on Sunday, but I wanted to give you guys a taste of what our show might look like in your neighborhood. So let's start off over here. We have Christopher Clark over here at the end. Hey, Chris, wave to us. There he is. Let's kind of do a little tour of the facility so you kind of get an idea of what this is all about. So we have different sections over here, as you can see. This is our Star Wars section over here. This is all Christopher Clark's artwork. All of it was uh, originated from actual originals that he paints with oils. And then these are the reproductions. Now, what's cool about this is if, it, if you purchase any of Christopher Clark's artwork at the show, he will sign it. But if it's canvas, which... You're looking at a lot of canvases here. You can see we have paper and canvas. But if you buy a canvas, Christopher will actually add paint embellishments. Those are highlights with his paintbrush. He'll actually do it live while you watch, which is really cool. We do allow photography. We allow you to mingle with everybody. We have a lot of cosplayers at these shows. It's just a lot of fun. Now, as you can see, we're in the Harry Potter section. Very popular area. They, people love Christopher's Harry Potter work. You can see the variety of different styles, different characters, different atmospheres of the Harry Potter artwork. Got, for example, Diagon Alley over here. We have Hermione here to the left. Now we're moving into the Game of Thrones. And again, a pretty wide variety of his Game of Thrones. This is Sunday. I think we've got a couple titles that may have sold out already, but for the most part, we're pretty well stocked for throughout the entire show. We're now moving into the Alice in Wonderland themes. Pretty cool stuff, as you can see. Again, you can see the canvases leaning against the walls here, and you can see the paper prints scattered about. Uh, we have prices that range everywhere for $5 for postcard greeting cards to uh, paper prints that are about $25. Christopher will even sign his greeting cards, which is pretty cool. So he really just likes to sign and add paint embellishments to everything to thank everyone. Now this is a different artist that we have, Heather Tyre. She's got this one masterpiece of Alice in Wonderland we just can't resist. So we bring her product to every show because it's just too awesome to neglect. Now we're moving into the DC Marvel areas. Wonder Woman, Batman, as you can see. We had a pretty strong approach, or pretty strong demand for the DC this weekend. We're filming this on Sunday, our last day of the show, so um, we usually have some larger pieces as well. Here's the Marvel artwork, and again, you can see all the paper prints, so customers have their choices. We do bring originals as well. Here's some uh, Baby Groot original and Superman. Those will probably be sold by the time you see this, but we have those available as well in prints. Lord of the Rings. Some pretty cool Lord of the Rings artwork. Some of the things I love about Chris is the, how he captures the faces. All of these were originally painted with oils. Now this is a reproduction we're looking at here, but the faces are just quite amazing. And then we're down here with a Moana piece that he did. We have another artist we bring in called Bucket. That's his actual name, Bucket. And this is his fun Star Wars parody art. So we always bring some of Bucket's stuff as well. It makes it kind of fun. But that's about it, folks. Here's a pretty good view of the entire room over here. We're going to be uh, opening the doors here probably in about 15 minutes. This is our Sunday, our last day in Houston. It's been a great show, and we hope to see you in your neck of the woods.